Hi, today we're going to look at adding a file upload to our form. Here's the contact form that we've used before, and we're going to add down here a space for the user to add a file to give us more information. We'll go to the Forms Manager. The file is open here. We're in the Preview window, and we'll drag in a File Upload element and move it up before the Submit button. We need to configure this. We're going to set a field name, File Upload. I'm going to copy and paste this. We'll need it again. We'll paste it into the ID so it's consistent. And down here, we'll add label text. Please upload a file. That's all for here for the moment. We'll click Apply. Close the modal window. And we can go to the Events tab. Here we need to add an action, an Upload Files action, to handle the files when they're uploaded. I'm going to configure this, make sure it's enabled. Here we specify the kind of files we allow. We put the name of the element in, a colon, and then a list of file types separated by dashes. Doc, docx, pdf, and text. That should be a dash, not an equals. The upload path is set by default to a folder in the Chronoforms folder. We'll leave that as it is. We'll leave the sizes as they are. Save the settings. Close the modal window. Save the form. Go back to the form. Refresh it so we can see the changes. There's a File Upload button. It'll vary depending on your browser what it looks like. We'll complete the form. Name, email, subject, message. I have a problem. Click the Choose File button. I have some sample test files here. We'll pick a doc file. We'll click Submit. Here we've got the debugger enabled, so we see the debugger information. There's the information about the file. And down here, I've added some code to show you the file that's been attached to the email. That's not a part of the standard Conoforms debug.